Hi, I'm Missionary Norman Edgar in Reynosa, Mexico. Uh, this is August 2011, and this is page number 40 of the Commands of Jesus, the Apostle and Evangelist. And these commands are to all Christians, and we will continue with 1 John 2.28. And now, little children, abide in him, that when he shall appear, we may have confidence and not be ashamed before him at his coming. 1 John 3.7. Little children, let no man deceive you. He that doeth righteousness is righteous, even as he is righteous. 1 John 3, 13. Marvel not, my brethren, if the world hate you. 1 John 3, 17. But whosoever hath this world's goods, and seeth his brother have need, and shutteth up his bowels of compassion from him, how dwelleth the love of God in him? My little children, let us not love in word, neither in tongue, but in deed and in truth. 1 John 3, 23. And this, is the, and this is his commandment, that we should believe on the name of his Son, Jesus Christ, and love one another as he gave us commandment. 1 John 4, 1. Beloved, believe not every spirit. But try the spirits, whether they are of God, because many false prophets are gone out into the world. 1 John 4, 7 Beloved, let us love one another, for love is of God, and everyone that loveth is born of God, and knoweth God. 1 John 4, 11 Beloved, if God so loved us, we ought also to love one another. 1 John 4.21 And this commandment have we from him, that he who loveth God love his brother also. 1 John 5.16 If any man see his brother sin a sin which is not unto death, he shall ask, and he shall give him life for them that sin not unto death. There is a sin unto death, I do not say that he shall pray for it. 1 John 5.21 Little children, keep yourself from idols. 2 John 1, 5 And now I beseech thee, lady, not as though I wrote a new commandment unto thee, but that which you have heard from the beginning, that we love one another. 2 John 1, 6 And this is love, that we walk after his commandments. This is the commandment, that as ye have heard from the beginning, you should walk in it. 2 John 1 8. I look to yourself that we lose, lose not those things which we have wrought, but that we receive a full reward. 2 John 1 10. If there come any unto you and bring not this doctrine, receive him not into your house, neither bid him Godspeed. 3 John 1 8. We therefore ought to receive such, that we might be fellow helpers to the truth. 3 John 1.11 Beloved, follow not that which is evil, but that which is good. He that doeth good is of God, but he that doeth evil hath not seen God. Jude 1.3 Beloved, when I gave all diligence to write unto you of the common salvation, it was needful for me to write unto you and exhort you that you should earnestly contend for the faith which was once delivered unto the saints. Jude 1.17 But, beloved, remember ye the words which were spoken before of the apostles of our Lord Jesus Christ, how that they told you there should be mockers in the last time who should walk after their own ungodly lusts. Jude one twenty, but ye beloved, build up your build up yourself on your most holy faith, praying in the Holy Ghost. Twenty one, keep yourself in the love of God, looking for the mercy of our Lord Jesus Christ unto eternal life. Jude one twenty two, and of some have compassion, making a difference and others save with fear, pulling them out of the fire, hating even the garment spotted by the flesh. 
Revelation 2 5 remember therefore from whence thou art fallen and repent and do the first works or else I will come unto you quickly and will remove thy candlestick out of its place except thou repent Revelation 2 7 he that had the ear let him hear what the Spirit saith unto the churches to him that overcometh will I give to eat of the tree of life which in the midst of God. Revelations 2.10 For none of those things which thou shalt suffer, behold, the devil shall cast some of you into prison, that you may be tried, and you shall have tribulation ten days. Be thou faithful unto death, and I will give thee a crown of life. Revelations 2.11 He that had the ear, let him hear what the Spirit saith unto the churches. He that overcometh shall not be hurt of the second death. Revelation 2.16 Repent, or else I will come unto thee quickly, and will fight against them with the sword of my mouth. Revelations 2.17 He that had the ear, let him hear what the Spirit saith unto the churches. To him that overcometh I will give to eat of the hidden manna, and will give him a white stone, and a stone, a new name written, which no man saith, he that receiveth it. Revelations 2.25 But that which you have already hold fast till I, which you have already hold fast till I come. Revelations 2.29 He that had the ear, let him hear what the Spirit saith unto the churches. Revelations 3, 2, be watchful and strengthen the things which remain. They are ready to die, for I have not found the works perfect before God. Revelations 3, 3, remember therefore how thou hast received and heard, and hold fast and repent. If therefore thou shalt not watch, I will come unto thee as a thief, and thou shalt not know what are, I will come upon thee. He that, Revelation 3, 6, he that had the ear, let him hear what the Spirit saith unto the churches. Revelation 3.11 Behold, I come quickly. Hold that, that fast which thou hast, that no man take thy crown. Revelation 3.13 He that had the ear, let him hear what the Spirit saith unto the churches. Revelation 3.19 As many as I love, I rebuke and chasten. Be zealous, therefore, and repent. Revelation 3.20 2. He that had the ear, let him hear what the Spirit saith unto the churches. Revelations 13, 18. Here is wisdom. Let him that hath understanding count the number of the beast, for it is the number of a man, and his number is six hundred, three score, and six. Revelation 14, 7. Saying with a loud voice, Fear God and give glory to him, for the hour of his judgment is come. And worship him that made heaven and earth and the sea and the fountains of water. Revelations 22, 11. He that is unjust, let him be unjust still. And he which is filthy, let him be filthy still. And he that is righteous, let him be righteous still. And he that is holy, let him be holy still. The final verse, Revelations 22, 17. And the spirit and the bride say, come, let him hear earth. Come, and let him that is thirst come, and whosoever will, let him take of the water of life freely. This concludes the commands of Jesus, the Apostle, and the Evangelist.